It's time for this week's Highlander Highlights. In women's soccer, Radford defeated UNC Asheville 3-0 on Saturday afternoon and claimed its fifth Big South Conference regular season championship. Jasmine Casares has got the scoring underway with her sixth goal in the past three matches. Nalia Perez notched her fourth tally on the season. The Highlanders posted its sixth shutout of the year and second in a row. The Highlanders held the Bulldogs to only eight shots. Radford will return home for the final regular season match on Tuesday at 4 p.m. when they play host to Charleston Southern at Cup Stadium. Radford will then host a Big South Conference tournament match on Saturday at 7 p.m. In men's soccer, the Highlanders extended its Big South winning streak to three matches with a 3-1 victory over Winthrop on Senior Day at Cup Stadium on Saturday. The Highlanders improved to 6-7 overall and 4-2 and in Big South play and stay tied for second place. Nine seniors were honored as part of Senior Day before Saturday's match. The senior class has been part of 44 wins, including 24 inside of Cup Stadium, as well as two Big South regular season championships. Kieran Roberts started the scoring with his sixth goal of the season. Amadou Mackie Jop followed with his seventh, and Corey Bennett finished off the scoring with a full field run for his second of the season. The Highlanders now play in what is arguably their biggest match of the season when they take on High Point at 7 p.m. this coming Saturday. The Radford volleyball team moved into sole possession of second place in the Big South Conference standings after sweeping the Winthrop Eagles on Dig Pink Day at the Dedman Center on Saturday. The Highlanders recorded their third straight victory and improved to 16-3 overall and 8-2 in the Big South. Junior Stephanie Neese recorded a match-high 13 kills on 23 attempts. Senior Valerie Gonzalez was also in double digits with 10 kills and added six digs. The Highlanders started the weekend by sweeping Gardner-Webb on Friday night 3-0 as juniors Mallory McKnight and Stephanie Neese led the way with 10 kills apiece. Radford will hit the road this week when they travel to Campbell and Hampton this coming Friday and Saturday for a pair of Big South Conference matches. In men's golf, the Highlanders completed play at the Elon Phoenix Invitational in a fourth place tie with Big South Conference rival Presbyterian last week. Radford played their best round of the event on Tuesday as five scores combined for a 280. Radford entered the day tied for 7th out of 16 schools that matched Temple and High Point for the lowest round of the day. Junior Peter Gasparini led the Highlander charge by firing a 68 over the final 18 holes to finish tied for 19th. Radford will be back in action November 4th through the 6th when they participate in the Kiowa Classic at Turtle Point, hosted by Charleston Southern in Kiowa, South Carolina. And finally in men's tennis. Radford wrapped up its fall campaign with the completion of the ITA Regionals this past Saturday. Matko Varga and Rodrigo Magajas each registered wins this past weekend. And that's a look at this week's Highlander Highlights. For RadfordAthletics.com, I'm Rick Watson.